We have accumulated everything that we need to become Emma Chamberlain for the day. I am addicted to Emma Chamberlain. She was like, do you want me to make you Emma Chamberlain's order? And I was like, yes. I literally watch Emma every week. Why not live like her? Hi guys and welcome back to Clever Style. If you guys spend any time at all on YouTube, you probably know who Emma Chamberlain is. She's a vlogger, she's a fashion icon at this point. She's kind of like everyone's favorite relatable girl who gets to live a very aspirational life. Yeah, it's funny because she's so relatable. Like, I loved her journey with her skin. She loves not wearing makeup. She's just yeah. like you. But then she's also like best friends with celebrities and gets dressed by Louis Vuitton and lives in like a gorgeous just home, same. AKA same. not like us. Honestly, I love, love, love Emma Chamberlain. I think she's a boss babe. And so we decided here at Clever that we love her so much, why not live like her? What? I'm so excited. I literally watch Emma every week. Emma, if you're watching. We have accumulated everything that we need to become Anna Chamberlain for the day. We got her journals, her sweatshirt, her merch, her phone cases, her food, her skincare. Everything. So basically, we're either gonna be super creepy and we'll have to get like restraining orders at the end of this video, or we'll become her. As the kids say, big things are coming. Good morning, Clever, and welcome back to Emma Chamberlain's vlogs. That's me being Emma. So we are gonna start off with face wash because I don't wanna go through my day and run errands with a dirty face. So I've wet my face. I absolutely loathe washing my face at my sink. I would rather just get naked and get in the shower, but because you guys are here, you can't go into the shower with me, so. Ooh, I like that it's green. Very fun and alien-like. Ooh, that smells so good. <sighs> It smells like a fresh morning in the country. And I'm obsessed. I absolutely love this. Let me put the moisturizer on because I just, this is exciting and we're on a roll here. Things are going uphill. All right, let's try this moisturizer. It's really cute packaging. I think this really makes sense for Emma because her whole thing is like, like I have bad habits, I guess. I really don't like these types of moisturizer containers because I feel like you don't really get to scrape out the bottom and the edges of the jar. This one's yellow. Okay. Mm. Oh, it smells like a bath, uh, bath and Body Works, like cucumber or something. Kind of has a nice vitamin C smell. Oh my gosh, this is nice. That like kind of citrus almost, but it's not overpowering. It's actually really nice and light smelling. I am addicted to Emma Chamberlain's skincare routine. Should I do some more? Honestly, don't forget your hands. <laughs> I could bathe in this. This stuff is like butter. Y'all know how I love butter. So far, so good. I really like this stuff. Well, sorry, I'm like getting a little weird because I haven't had my coffee yet, which is so unlike Emma. Emma is like the biggest coffee lover. Coffee, 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 coffee. coffee. She has her own coffee brand. Shout out Chamberlain Coffee. But one thing we didn't account for is the fact that I don't have a coffee maker anymore and my cold brew maker got like moldy, so. I needed to regroup, rethink, and then we remembered Emma loves Phil's. And there is a Phil's coffee in Hollywood. So, okay, I'm either gonna Postmate it, which is very Emma, or I'm gonna brave the world and go get it. So while I think about that, we need to change our clothes. So you can't truly become Emma Chamberlain without wearing Emma Chamberlain merch, which I am, everyone. Get excited. Excited. Emma sweats. Yay! I really love these two items. This shirt has cats on it. It has like a devil cat, an angel cat, and then the sleeves coincide with do it or don't do it. Okay, so I think what would be like most appropriate is just to put this on and brave the world. Let's do that. These sweatpants are so comfortable. They're in a size large, which is a size larger than I normally would get. But I do like that they're extra roomy. They have pockets. They're really comfy and cozy. They fit really well. And then the sweatshirt is actually in a small, which I probably would have gotten a little bit larger of a size. Guys, what do we think? The only problem, and I was debating even talking about this, but just to mention, because together, like, they're such good quality. The sweatshirt is super warm. These pants are really Really cute and like comfortable. There was like a little tiny hole in my pocket. Sad, but that's okay. 
I don't know if you know this, but Emma loves coffee so much that she basically created, no, she did create her own coffee brand. It's called Chamberlain Coffee. I've actually tried this. I have some in my pantry as we speak, and I like it so much that I also have the craft that I drink out of every single day. Emma has hot coffee and cold brew. She created these little packets that you can steep in water overnight, especially for the cold brew. You don't have to do this for the hot. For the cold brew, you steep the packet overnight, and the next morning, Morning, you have a delicious, delicious, take my word for it, cup of Emma Chamberlain's cold brew. All right, we have secured the fills. Okay, I'm really nervous because I don't think I'm gonna like this, but. And I said, I go, sorry, I look kind of crazy. I'm like, wearing all Emma Chamberlain merch. I'm filming a day in the life of Emma Chamberlain, and she was like, do you want me to make you Emma Chamberlain's order? And I was like, yes, and she's like, we make it all the time, so bottoms up. So Emma takes her coffee a very particular way. She did an entire YouTube video on how she makes her coffee. This is the Nut Pods Almond Coconut Creamer French Vanilla Unsweetened and Dairy Free Creamer. And she uses this almond milk and she mixes these two together. Let's do a little ASMR, shall we? And this is the official Emma Chamberlain cold brew. Ooh. Okay. Okay. I don't know why anyone would get this. I'm. It tastes literally so bitter. Large iced dancing water with almond milk, no sweet. So I drink her cold brew all the time. It's really good, it's light, it's very palatable. If you think cold brew is too strong, it's probably a really good option for you because it's not overpowering, but it works. Coffee is fire. I mean, meh. But like, love that for Emma. Okay, let's go home and make some Emma Chamberlain breakfast. So it's time for breakfast. Emma has a very particular breakfast order that she makes every single day, um, and that includes over hard eggs with avocado, salt and pepper, everything but the bagel sauce, sauce, seasoning, and bread, which sounds sort of delicious, but I'm not really sure about the over hard part. Everyone hates on me because I burned my eggs. I love it. Funny enough, I actually do two fried eggs for breakfast every single day, and that was what she said she has for breakfast, but she does them super, super well done, she said. So I'm kind of not really doing bread right now, so I'm microwaving some rice. Spraying my pan down, first egg going in. I think that worked. Second egg. Just gonna do a little bit of salt. A little bit of pepper. That's a lot of bit of pepper. Everything but the bagel seasoning. Yum. Ooh. I also have my bread toasting in this pan, so I'm gonna give it a little flippy flip flop. You guys, I'm so Emma right now. So I have my two fried eggs, fried well done, avocado, cholula, salt, pepper, everything but the bagel, and my Phil's coffee. Okay, it smells so good. I'm like very, very excited to try it. I don't know if the avocado is super um, ripe, so let's just hope for the best. Oh my goodness. I wonder how she eats it. She, she didn't say how she eats it. Like I wonder if she just takes it like a like an open face sandy and just eats it like this or does she use a fork like a sophisticated person. I'm not sophisticated so I'm gonna eat it like a hand sandy. Put a little Cholula, which is very potent. Um. This is delicious. Wash it down with the little fills. Okay, this is like really growing on me. I'm very surprised because I did not think I would like it at all. I'm a happy camper. All right, I'm gonna eat this. Sorry, that's gross. So Emma is a very successful YouTuber. She obviously has a ton of brands, a ton of collaborations, companies, or content. Like she is a boss lady. And she also has her own journal to help other people become bosses just like she is. So I feel like I should dive into some of these pages because there's a lot to do in here. So if you ever get bored or you wanna just kind of zone out a little bit and do a crossword puzzle, those are in here. Okay, this already takes me back to being in like middle school and high school because it's so interactive and fun and like, oh, I really like this. I'm gonna jump into this would you rather quiz. The first one is would you rather wear a bright yellow wig for a month. You guys know how I feel about wigs on this channel. 
I think you look beautiful. Actually, it looks better on than it does in hand. Oh, so kind of you. Just or wear a bright purple wig for a month. Honestly, I've dyed my hair purple, so I definitely would do that one. <laughs> this one's very much me. Would you rather always have a huge coffee stain on the front of your shirt, or would you rather tuck your jeans into your socks every time you wear jeans? This is already a part of my wardrobe staple, so that to me is an easy choice. The next step in becoming Emma Chamberlain is hooking up our phone cases. She did a collaboration with Wildflower Cases. She's done this before. She's had other cases with them, but this is her latest collaboration. And I'm gonna take one of her very famous mirror selfies. Here is my setup. <laughs> very sophisticated. So here's my first phone. I've set it up here. And then I'm going to pose with this one, looking as though I'm looking into an actual mirror, but no mirror here, there's just lots of bounty paper towels. <laughs> I feel ridiculous. It is a couple hours later, I took a shower, I put some makeup on, and I am actually wearing the Emma Chamberlain edit from Princess Polly. So I'm gonna try to shoot a few photos to be sort of like insta-worthy. I'm actually really happy with like a handful of these. So I feel like I'm really on my way to becoming Emma Chamberlain. I think the next step is going to have to be dinner. And Erin and I have gotten some insider scoop that she loves Tokaya. So we're going to Postmates some Tokaya and maybe do a little like nighttime routine. Ooh, with her skincare. All right, it is time to unwind from the day of being at Emma Chamberlain, which honestly is very exhausting. I watched a lot of YouTube videos and did a lot of journaling. So it is time to now try part of Emma's like evening routine, nighttime skincare routine. Back to my bad habit. This is the 10 minute rehab green juice charcoal detox mask. So this is like a standard looking, char oh. It looks kind of like a standard charcoal mask. It smells really good. It smells really fresh. There's like a minty vibe going on. It's very liquidy, it's very thin. I feel like a little bit goes a long way with this stuff. Okay, it's very tingly. Oh, it's starting to change color. I look like Shrek. <laughs> Actually, I look like Fiona. Uh. Okay, so I just washed my face mask off and I think my skin actually looks really good. I prefer that minty face wash over the mask, but the face wash and the moisturizer were so good. I think I'm kind of a little bit of a big fan. All right guys, in true Emma Chamberlain fashion, we got some Tokaya, I'm so excited. I love Tokaya, and so the fact that Emma loves Tokaya and Linus loves Tokaya, it's like, what an exciting time. I ordered a burrito. My favorite food has been burritos. And I also got some chips and guac and some salsa. I'm literally just gonna chill and eat this and just enjoy it, I'm so excited. Tokaya is one of those kind of bougie, elevated, more organic take on more traditional Mexican food, although it feels not truly Mexican. Again, it has a lot of Mexican flair, a lot of Mexican undertones. They used to make amazing margaritas before COVID. <laughs> I miss Takaya margaritas. But you know, honestly, getting Takaya delivered to my house is the next best thing. I really loved becoming Emma Chamberlain today. I think the clothes are everything. The facial products are everything. I think the only thing that I didn't really necessarily gravitate towards was the journal, but that's because this is already a part of my wardrobe staples. We'll link everything from this video down in the description below if you would like to shop anything from the vid. And you guys, who should we live like next? Also, if you'd like to see us do more videos here on Clever Style, we have a few just for you. Click right over here.